hello how to simplify this nice math problem without using calculator we have square root of 36 divided by 6 minus square root of 35 solution then we have square root of 36 divided by 6 minus square root of 35 let's rationalize the denominator that is is multiplied by 6 plus square root of 35 divided by 6 plus square root of 35 and this is equal to well square root of here is 36 bracket 6 plus square root of 35 divided by 6 minus square root of 35 bracket 6 plus square root of 35. Then this is equal to 36 multiplied by 6 equal to square root of we have 36 multiplied by 6 that is 216 then plus 36 multiplied by square root of 35 this is 36 root 35 divided by this is in the form of a plus b bracket a minus b then which is equal to a square minus b square then this can be written as c square minus square root of 35 square then this is equal to square root of here we have 216 plus 36 square root of 35 divided by this is c square that is 36 minus this we cancel this 35 then this is equal to square root of we have 216 plus 36 square root of 35 divided by 36 minus 35 that is 1 then this is equal to square root of 216 plus 36 root 35 and this x we want to express this in this form that is a square plus b square plus 2 a b is equal to a plus b square now here this is equal to we have square root of 216 plus this 36 can be written as 2 multiplied by 18 multiplied by the root of 35 now this is equal to we have square root of 216 plus here we have 2. This 18 can be written as square root of 18 square. Then multiply by square root of 35. So this is equal to we have square root of 216 plus 2 
then multiply by the whole of this can be written as square root of 18 multiply by 18 multiply by this 35 can be written as 5 multiply by 7 and this is equal to square root of we have 2 1 6 plus 2 multiply by let's multiply this 18 by 5 and this 18 by 7 this become square root of 18 multiplied by 5 that is 90 multiplied by 18 multiplied by 7 that is 126 then this is equal to we have square root of now this is 216 plus here is 2 multiply by this can be written as root 90 multiply by root 90 multiply by root 126 then from here if we check 126 plus 90 this is going to give you 216 this is 6 9 plus 2 that is 11 1 remain 1 1 plus 1 that is 2 so you can see that 90 plus 126 is going to give you 216 then this is equal to we have square root of these 216 can be written as 90 plus 126 plus 2 square root of 90 then square root of 126 then from here if you have a square plus b square plus 2ab this is equal to a plus b or square now this is equal to our square root of here can be written as square root of 90 square plus this can be written as square root of 216 square plus then 2 square root of 90 square root of 216 then that is a is equal to square root of 90 and then b is equal to square root of 216 so and of course this should be equal to a plus b or square so this is equal to square root of the whole of this must be equal the whole of this is equal to this which is square root of 90 plus square root of 126 or square now this we cancel this this is equal to square root of 90 plus square root of 126 but square root of 90 is equal to square root of 9 multiplied by 10 and square root of 126 is equal to square root of 9 multiplied by 14 then this is equal to square root of 9 multiplied by 10 plus square root of 9 multiplied by 14 then this is equal to square root of 9 multiplied by square root of 10 plus square root of 
9 multiplied by the square root of 14. And this is equal to square root of 9 is 3 multiplied by 10. That is root 10 plus square root of 9 is 3 multiplied by 14. That is root 14. And as you can see, 3 is common. This is equal to 3 bracket. If you divide this by this, we have root 10. Plus, if you divide this by this, we have root 14. And this is the final answer. Therefore, square root of 36 divided by 6 minus square root of 35 is equal to 3 bracket square root of 10 plus square root of 14. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.